What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Shield version walkthrough. No, 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 no. What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to our... What's up guys, it's me, your badass... Ah, God damn it. What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Sword and Shield walk through the Isle of Armor episode right here for Shield version. And, well, in our last episode, we have a, we had a little bit of an introduction right here, you know, getting the lay of the land and all that stuff. And now it is time for us to actually go to the Master Dojo because apparently there is something there that we need to do. Now, I didn't do anything off screen, guys. Trust me, didn't do anything. Just, uh,. Stayed there, getting the lay of the land and all that stuff. And well, now it is time for us to actually go uh, and actually do some big boy stuff and whatnot. Uh, there is an item right there that I want to get. Plus, there are Pokemon here that I want to get too. I didn't notice this. But yes, guys, uh, after a long time, long time coming, I finally returned to both Pokemon Sword and Shield. I have separated both both games so we can see the differences in both sword and shield and well here is one thing that we're going to be looking at right now d d d d oh damn it's uh in a lowland diglet right here and oh diglet you're here <laughs> you little rascal i was worried about you dig thank you for finding my diglet uh, is it from Alola? Yes, it is from Alola. Oh, I didn't expect to meet someone who knows about it. That's right, this is a Diglett from Alola region. When I traveled to Alola, I fell in love with these adorable three hairs. I caught a lot of Diglett uh, there and came back, but they went somewhere when I looked away for a second. Diggly! Anyway, you found a Diglett buried in the, gr in the ground. You definitely have a talent for finding Diglett. If it's okay, will you find all other Diglett too? Uh, you know, we have no choice in this, guys. We really don't. And, uh, well, take a look at how many Diglett he's found. Okay, so, oh, what kind? What a kind person you are. Words can't express how grateful I am. You found one Diglett so far, so please find 150 more. Yeah, this guy literally caught 151 Alolan Diglets. Man, what the hell is the matter with you? If you find them, please uh, please uh, tell them to come back for me. Yeah. 151 Alolan Diglets. You know how hard that's going to be? Oh, my God. Yeah, so not only do we have to, like, look for these Diglets, but we have uh, quite a few things that we have to accomplish here, too. And it's going to be so hard for me to just remember everything. Holy crud. Okay, so... Anywho, the way to actually find these Diglets, it's very simple. Just find their little three hairs, and yeah, you'll be able to find these guys. Now, in our last episode, too, we met uh, we met somebody here, and look at this guy. There he is with his psychic Pokemon. Oh, Fiddlesticks! So our new student decided to go back home? It would appear so. I'll have you know my offer to escort them was perfect. He rather abluntly esconded after our battle. I do not know what that word means, but it's esconded. And I'd be hoping, uh, I, I've been hoping we'd get uh, to welcome a new member to our little family here, too. Well, hello. And you are, love? Hmm. Gah! Of course. You must be the new student that's supposed to join the dojo today. Uh, sure? Yes, right. That's correct, ma'am. I swear, I thought that uh, you used teleport or something and you disappeared so quickly. Regardless, it gives me a great joy to know that you decided to come after all. Oh, everything's just coming up roses. Now I'm quite sure that they already told me, but your name, but... Uh, it's Draven. That's right, you're Draven. Of course you are, love. Though, I'm not sure that that's not the name I was told before. My name is Honey. I help keep this place running. You can consider me the lady of the house. Not that the master dojo is just an old, uh, an old house. But why? For what purpose is he here? My future sight might be off. I must think before Miss Honey figures out that I told. Uh, or you need to read this correctly. God dang it! Before Miss Honey figures out, I told an innocent little lie. 
Since you've already met our Avery, bit of an odd ducklet, but he is one of our own. He's training hard here to, uh, in the dojo so he can become a gym leader someday. I can trust the two of you can get along, right? <laughs> it's an honor to make your acquaintance. Oh dear, but look at me. Here I am talking, uh, making you stand around outside after you've come all this way. Come in, come in! Don't mind the faint stench of sweat. Now listen. If you dare breathe a word of what happened at the station to Miss Honey. Well, let's just say my psychic powers are very potent. Do I make myself clear? Uh, okay, weirdo. Okay, and uh, well, look at that. Who is waiting for us up in the stars right there? <laughs> Not the stars, but just up in the sign right there. Wow, he, he escaped quickly. Okay, so let's see. Before we go into the dojo, there is an item here. There's two items, maybe. Find ourselves a tiny mushroom. Oh, would you look at that? We found ourselves a diglet. So that's two. We got 17 more. God! Seriously! Who captures 151 of the same Pokemon? I want to know that. Probably that guy. He's probably on crack or something. But as you can see, we are locating some stuff right here. And, uh, well, it looks like we found another guy right here. So that's three. So that's three Diglets. Good gravy. Oh my god. And, well, before, again, we, before we go into that dojo, we're just going to grab some items here and there. There's not, there's definitely not a lot of stuff to do except just this. Like the Focus Blast. Definitely a good move to actually use if you're very, very, very focused, which I'm not. And, well, let's see. We can get some wattage. We can get this. Get ourselves a bottle of HP up. And there we go. Grab that. And what else can we get? Not the Benary. Don't want to go up against the Benary. And look at this. This guy is just hiding everywhere. Look at that. Okay, so that is uh, four Diglets right there. Now let's go straight inside the dojo. You got to look everywhere, guys. And I mean everywhere. They're not going to shine, but their three hairs are going to show. And what is that? Okay, never mind. Thought I saw something. So let's go inside the dojo, and would you look at that. They're all over the place! Yeah, some stuff that I failed to uh, to see in the Pokemon Sword version. So, here we are, Daddy's home, and let's see what they're all about. Oh, damn. Oh, man. Everybody, I have, annou have, annou I have, have, I have an announcement to make. We've got a new student joining us today. Please welcome Draven. I'm sure you'll have lots to teach him. <laughs> welcome to the dojo. All our students are so good and hardworking. Everybody ge uh, really gives it their all around here. Now, here's someone who's not listening in my database of students. Hello, Scootie Pie. It's not usual for you uh, to bother greeting a newcomer. This is Hyde, my darling son. Are you some kind of outlier? Here, you should give this a try. And well, we're going to be getting ourselves an experience charm. I don't know what that does. A charm that increases the experience points that Pokemon can get. A machine-like object that is inside the charm. Huh. Don't open it, okay? It's got tech I develop inside, and I don't want you to, uh, to go and ruin it. He's, he's so good with his hands, always making something new. Such a clever boy. And that handsome gent in the back is my darling hubby and the very master of this dojo. Huh, it's Master do Master Roshi? Yeah, like I said, in Sword Version, he finally got lucky. Look at this guy. Wow, she's really into old men. Why, hello there. My name is Mustard. I'm rather good with Pokemon battles, you know. I'm pleased as she's to, uh, uh, that you could join us. Uh, please, it's cheesed. Okay, I've never heard that expression before, but okay, uh, cheese to meet you. <laughs> I see you've got a sense of humor, too! Good, good! Don't let him fool you into thinking he's just a silly old man. He's a real beast when it gets serious. I'm pretty sure of that, huh? Giggity. Well, darling, I'll have to... I'll leave the rest up to you. Yay, this is my favorite part. I want to see how good you really are. So why not have a battle with the little old me? Just say the word when you're ready. Okay, well, uh, let's see. I can, uh, I can 
I could do that. Let's see. Uh, do I have... Uh, okay, so... I... Yeah, I completely forgot about the Pokemon I have in my team. I know that I have Zemazenta on my team, so... Let's see if I could switch him out for somebody... A little more... Uh, well, a little more seasoned on my team right here. So, let's see. Who did I, who did I swap him out with? Could have sworn I swapped him out with a psychic type Pokemon right here. Huh. He's right here somewhere. Yeah. Wh who did I who did I swap him out with? Krakatoa, there's a Pokemon. Oh yeah. I think. Nope, I didn't swap swap him out for Gaia. Swapped him out for somebody right here. Let's see. I'm looking at I'm trying to look for this guy. Uh not Dumbledore. Rapidash. No, I didn't swap him out for Rapidash. Let's see. Ah, there you are, Mr. Rhyme. Okay, so we got Marcel right here. Completely forgot to uh, put him on there. And, well, let's see. Screw it. Let's go with Marcel since it is a psychic type Pokemon as well. So let's go right ahead and take on good old Mass Roshi. Yahoo! Are you ready to battle? Yes, I am. Okay. All right, let's get this show started. This is the best way to know my new students. Okay, so here we go. Battle up against Dodge, uh, Dojo Mastered Mustard. Try saying that five times. And, well, he's coming out with Mind Fu. And we're going to be coming out with Marcel. It's been a while, buddy. Yippee! Oh, I can't wait to see you in battle. Your heart out. Okay, let's see. What can we do right here? Go with a psychic attack because, well, obviously, and well, here comes a fake out attack. Doesn't really work that much. So let's try it again. Let's go for a psychic attack. And this one will take care of Mind Fu. And he's like, oh, super duper effective. Oh, I smell danger. Mm hmm. Super duper danger. Okay, look at this. Okay, and well, here he's going to be coming out with a Shink. So let's go ahead and switch him out. Let's go straight for... Yeah, let's go straight for Drago right here. Ivan Drago. Okay, so how you doing, buddy? It has been a while, and... Ooh, it looks like my little old self has been cornered. I've been getting the shivers. And here comes a Shanks, which you can actually get in this area. And, well, let's see. Let's go right ahead and go with the Bulldoze attack right here. So, Bulldoze for the win, and that nearly wins it all for us, but no, it just decreases its speed. And here comes a spark attack, not so effective, and just like that, we get paralyzed, seriously. But we're faster, and we're mightier. So there we go, a, a bulldoze attack for the win, and just like that, we defeat the old man. That was everything I hoped for and more! It was. It really was. Okay, so... After that, everybody's shocked and like, Bah! <laughs> I lost! You're pretty strong, aren't you? Hey, the newbie won! Master wasn't going all out, but that's still pretty impressive. Who is this kid, anyway? Alrighty, okay. The way you battle really shows how much you care about your Pokémon. Even if you've come because of a misunderstanding, as long as you have the will to learn. Then you're welcomed at the Master Dojo. I think we can all help each other uh, become stronger. I'm happy. Uh, I'm happy you've come to join us. So on that note, here's your Dojo uniform. And there we go. We got ourselves a Dojo uniform. And uh, well, look at this. We're looking pretty snazzy in it. Look at that. Oh yeah. Very snazzy. Super snazzy. With that on, you'll fit right in with the students of my Master Dojo. Hey, newbie! If you want to change or just take a break, use that room over there! Yeah, it looks like we're gonna we're gonna use this whole new uniform right here just to, you know, take care of business. Now then! With Draven uh, here now, the dojo's at max capacity. It's time to really start our training. You'll, you'll all be facing three trials! Three trials? Wait, why is there a max capacity for this dojo? And there's more. The person who completes the three trial, the three trials will receive a secret armor of this dojo. Ho <laughs> ho! A secret set of armor I want in! 
That's the spirit. Now let me explain the tr first trial. Pardon me, Master. I haven't received my uniform yet. I dis I dare say it's unfair for you to that the child to get a uniform unequal even. I demand an even swap or an item swap. Oh dear. Do you really not have a uniform? My bad. My bad. That's easy for. Uh, that's easy to fix though. I have another uniform right here for you, Avery. Ha! It does pay to complain sometimes. And as soon as he get his uniform, he gets uh, nope. <laughs> you don't get a uniform. Eek! What in the world? Hey, my dojo uniform, it's gone missing. Po po po. Hmm. And just like in uh, just like in sword version, I'm going to say it right here. You've heard of a Squirtle squad. Now look at this uh, the Slowpo squad. Poke. That speed. Was it really the Slowpoke? I've never seen any Slowpoke move that fast. How dare you? Are you using trick? Return my dojo uniform immediately. Slow, 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 slow. Hook! I think that was the equivalent of like, I'm flipping you off, man. <laughs> oh my, where do you think you're going? Oops. Guess I let them out of their Pokeballs a little too soon. <laughs> Master, what's up with those Slowpoke? This is the first trial, my students. You've got to chase after all those fast Slowpokes and train with care by little old me. But that's not all. You need to defeat them too. And while you're at it, could you, you know, get Avery's do dojo uniform back too? Aw, do we have to? Well, that's that. Do your best, you lot. Oh, damn. Okay, so... <laughs> I guess he's gonna go chill while we try and go get that uniform back. Yeah, everybody's just surprised right here. And they're looking at each other like, yeah, I'm gonna beat you. Okay. Alrighty. So, do you want to change back into your uniform? No, because this is a pretty snazzy uniform right here. So we're going to go ahead and capture those slow pokes. So, now, once we step outside, the slow pokes are going to be waiting for us. And they're going to indicate to us where we need to go. As you can see, they're just mocking us and running all the way to that area right there. Holy crud. These guys are fast. What do you call a... What is the opposite of a slowpoke? I want to know that. Anywho, stay tuned, guys. In the next episode, you probably already watched it in Sword version, but you're going to be seeing it here in Shield version 2. We're going to be going to chase the slowpoke in a little bit quicker fashion. And then from there, just continue on in our adventure. Again, we got both Sword and Shield version. These videos will be coming out once every weekend. This will actually give me enough time to actually, you know, complete the whole thing. Do a little bit more of the challenges and all that stuff and capture some Pokemon behind the scenes, guys. So, again, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for being patient with me. I will be back for another episode of Pokemon Sword version right here next weekend. And well, we're going to see what, what happens with these slowpokes. So, I'll see you guys next time.